I dare you not to sing along to this. Ooh, harmony. Nice, Patrick. We should re-record that with just our voices. Those two guys are great. Great idea. But frankly, we could screw them over and take it. I could add a wiki wiki. Yeah. yeah, really. Yeah, well, yeah. Super yeah. dope. Yeah. On second thought. <laughs> yeah, never mind. Uh, all right, number six. Uh, we told you a little bit about this yesterday in the 8 a.m. show. The hottest new class at your gym, resting. More gyms are added in recovery rooms. They're dimly lit areas with pillows, mats, massage chairs, soft music where people can go to cool down and relax once they're done working out. Wow. In some cases, people can just go straight to the recovery room and skip the workout. Mm. Gym owners say coming out of the pandemic, more people are calling for gentler classes like yoga and meditation. They find that the people care more about how they feel than how they look. Huh. Mm. All right, number five. Just when you thought romance was dead, we found this website, romanticallywritten.com. You can sign up to receive weekly letters filled with stories of 19th century love and intrigue. Oh, wow. According to the website, it's like being pen pals with Jane wow. Austen. Wow, Rob, you this will is be, like right? your fantasy. Me you too. will be paired with a fictional Regency-era cousin, and she is eager to spill all the tea about her life. Oh. You can sign up for one week, one month, or depending on how a, often you'd like to get a, a letter. A lifetime. A lifetime, I mean, wow. subscription. Yeah. Wow. yeah. So it's basically the adult version of an imaginary friend. <laughs> is, what it, is what it is. Yes, and it's written <laughs> in here. Can you imagine here having so few real and, friends that yes. you do this? You're right. Uh, oh, I know. Oh, oh, man, that sounds great. <laughs> <laughs> Number I'm four. Bowling. More bars are adding mocktail hours. It's the same idea as a traditional happy bar. Uh, getting together with friends, usually after work for a few laughs, a few drinks, and some snacks. Only mocktails are alcohol free. Not only that, booze free bars are opening up across the country where all beverages are alcohol free. Yay. Can't you just order an alcohol free drink at a regular bar during yeah, happy probably. hour? Yeah, probably. probably. If you don't want to be around all those drunks. Yeah. Ah. You know? Uh, number three, fun fact about kale, everybody. <laughs> oh, all right. Until 2013, Pizza Hut was the biggest buyer of kale in the United States. It didn't go on the pizza. They used it to decorate oh, the salad Oh, look bar. at oh, that. Yeah. 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 It's in How about bar. that? Who knew you could just pick that out of the salad bar right, and munch yeah. on it, right? Mm -hmm. All right, number two, another unique item from an award show swag bag because celebrities are just like us, and sometimes even they have to deal with a clogged toilet. A poop uh. emoji plunger from the same people who brought you the squatty potty. Ooh. Do you know what the squatty oh, potty yeah, that is? That little a life stool changer. that you use. You got one of those, Tori? No. <laughs> She's not 100 years old. You don't need to be 100 years old to try and straighten out your colon, Robin. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it's, it's science. Anyway, this is ideal for celebrities who deal with a lot of stuff every day. I'm mm. not saying that. No. <laughs> you can get it at $14.97 on Amazon. Currently sold out, though. Oh, oh some sure. Sure. Sold You know, out. they take those bags, they pay taxes on them. You know that? Really? I had no idea. Yeah. Swag bag? Yeah, this yeah. would be like forty, fifty thousand dollars worth of stuff. Yeah. They get to pay taxes. Careful. Yeah. Yeah. See? Keep me up here a little longer. You learned some things. Yeah. Number yeah. one, yesterday we showed you a clip from the low, low budget movie Velocipaster. Yeah. About a down on his luck priest who goes to China and turns into a dinosaur. Hopefully we're getting another look. Hopefully we see him turning into yeah. a dinosaur this time. That's let's right. take a look. Last night was amazing. What are you talking about? Time you turn into a dinosaur and eat some. What? Dinosaurs. <laughs> uh, the old classic ninja versus dinosaur trope. Yeah. I've seen that once. Have I've you? seen yeah. it a hundred right. times. Uh, oh, clearly, yeah. all the money went into the uh, dinosaur costume. The movie gets a 5.1 on IMDb. Wow. Which is uh, surprisingly high. One, what is... re one reviewer said, don't expect Hamlet or Gone with the Wind with this one. Really? Huh. There you go. All right. There we go. That's the six at six. Oh.